There's those four little words that Oklahoma ranchers at this time of the year rather despise, those four words being high pressure heat dome. And here we are, it seems like we're in the midst of one of those situations where the uh, temperatures stay in the high 90s, low, double, triple digits, and, and it seems to stay for quite a while. What that means in terms of working cattle in the summertime is we may, need to choose our times rather carefully. There was an interesting study done here by Dr. Wedeman uh, eight or nine years ago where they used rumen boluses that could send radio signals to a nearby computer that would record the internal body temperature of range cows uh, every hour so they could keep track of what the core body temperature was doing throughout the day. They did that at, at several different times of the year, but the one that perhaps most resembles what we experienced here in the summertime in 2020 is uh, they had a June day with a high temperature of 93 degrees and uh, then in, later in the evening it got down as low as about 88 degrees around seven o'clock. As they watched the body temperature of the cows during that particular day, what they noticed was that when the outside temperature in the air actually started to level off and decrease, the internal body temperature of the cows continued to increase. You see, when it was 93 degrees at four o'clock, then the internal body temperature of the cows was averaging 102.2 degrees Fahrenheit. As the temperature dropped to about 88 degrees at 7 p.m., the internal body temperatures of these cows had actually raised one full degree up to about 103.3 degrees Fahrenheit. That tells me that if we have any working to do with cattle during the summertime, we want to avoid that situation in the late afternoon, even early evening hours, we must wait until nighttime cooling has allowed these cows to cool down. So we wanna do any cattle working that we're going to do in the early morning hours, if at all possible. This is especially true if you're still doing some artificial insemination. If you're trying to breed cows when their uh, body temperature is elevated, we know from research that that will impair the conception rates of those cattle. And some other research done here in Oklahoma back in the 80s indicated that an increase in body temperature for 14 days after the cow has been bred will actually compromise the health and the viability of that new young growing embryo. So I think we want to really be careful if we're doing any cattle working in the heat of the summer Try to do it in the early morning hours. Let's avoid those late afternoon, evening hours. That's when the body temperature will be the highest. Stress on the cattle will be the highest. And quite frankly, stress on you as well. Keep that in mind. And I think it'll help during this summer and any summer that we're working cattle. Hey, we look forward to visiting with you again next week on Sunup's Cow-Calf Corner.